Hi, my name's Cheryl Preston, Independent Stamping Up Demonstrator here in Sydney, Australia. How are you? Today I'm going to look at the ring with nature. It's the first time I've used this stamp set, so I'm excited to use it. And you can see here I've got a lot of stamps out. I am going to case the catalogue once again. I'm having so much fun doing that and I'm learning techniques as I go. So something for you to think about. So this is the one I'm going to do here. And it's page 44 of the annual catalogue. Okay. I've roughly cut paper out and things just to make it a little bit easier. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to be using grey granite, mossy meadow, daffodil delight, calypso coral and lost lagoon. Okay. And the cardstock is petal pink. So let's get started. So I've roughly cut out the little pieces here just so I have a map of what I'm doing so first one we'll get the perfect to, to light out and we'll get this one I think I've obviously got it in the camera I'll just move that out of the way so you can see see it better and I'm going to stamp and I'm just going to turn it so I've got that wider bit just there. And I'm just going to stamp that down. Just like that. So that's the end of Daffodil Delight. We don't need that anymore. And we're going to get out our Calypso Coral. And we're going to do the centre. So we've got that little stamp. And we're just going to do the center. It's a bit hard with the camera, so hopefully I get it. So there you are. So we'll finish with that stamp. We still need Calypso, so I'll put it back in the pack. And next is Lost Lagoon. And we're going to do the little leaf. So there's a little leaf. And we're going to bring that in. See if I can get it. Not too bad. Not perfect, but not too bad. We'll still need that. So that one we'll just leave there. The next one here we're going to do. You can see that there. Um, it's the mushroom. We're going to do a mushroom. So we're going to get out our grey granite for the mushroom. stamp it towards the bottom just like so okay put that we still need that one we're going to get the calypso coral out but we're going to stamp off this time so we're going to get the mushrooms put that back there we're going to get them nice and juice up stamp off and then we're going to, sorry, I'll just see if I can get this a bit so I can see. Yeah. So there you are, we've got that one done. So then I'm just going to get my, where have I put it? Where have I put it? Um, oh, here it is. My stamp and scrub and I'm just going to clean the mushroom heads off because I'll need that in a minute so just to be prepared myself so I don't forget uh, we're going to get this one and we are going to use the berries and the leaf so we're going to get mossy meadow Stamp it up well, and we're going to sort of put it at an angle, just like that. And then I might need to restamp that somehow. Um, not restamp, re-ink my mossy meadow, and we're going to get the Clipso coral out. And 
the berries. I don't know what they are. I'm just calling them berries because I don't know what they are. And just put them there. So we'll put that there so we know where we are. Next is the house. Put that away. So we need uh, grey granite and lost lagoon. I'm going to do the roof first. I found that easier to do. And I'm going to put the roof there. Just like that. And put that because I still need that. And lost lagoon. And I'm just going to match that up as well as I can. And there we have our house. Oh, I've missed a little bit there. A bit hard with the camera. Let me see if I can try a bit better. So, try it this way. Lost Lagoon. Hard with the camera in your face, trying to line it all up. There, yeah, now it's close enough. So there, we need that out still, and we're going to do this one, and we need the leaves and the mushrooms and. So we need um, grey granite, we need that, and we need mossy meadow. So we we'll start with the mossy meadow. And we're going to use the leaf going down that way. Okay, you can t definitely tell that I need to use reading that one. Now I'm going to uh, how we're we going to do this. I think it might be better to do this part first. Too close. Mm. It's going to be hard. No, I think I might have to do it this way. Put one there, one there, and one coming down there. See if that makes it easier for me to line up. better but I find out a paper doing it that way don't I how's that I oh, know not real good no that's not good enough okay let's start again it's very hard to line everything up isn't it so we'll get the leaf do it on the edges it might be a bit more ink Okay, so we're going to do it like that, and then we're going to get these, and drop it down a bit. Try there like that. And now we'll see if this works. I'll just put these inks away. Okay. So we've got 
this one. That's better, isn't it? Yeah, that's a lot better. So there you are. We're all learning as we go. Yuck. So we've got that. Okay, here's our little template there. So the only stamping we've got left is the sentiment. And we can do that. Um, we're going to use Calypso Coral. And I'm just going to put it there. And we're going to do it this way. Might as well put the center in. I like using the white, the piece of white for the card, even though this is light, it just adds a little bit of texture to it. So we've got that done. Now we're just going to do these, and we just need some dimensionals, and we're just going to put dimensionals on all of these. up on another project what I haven't done was measure it all to make sure they fitted so hopefully they do they're close anyway and wait, I'll just do these ones and then I'll work it out so I have cut them, but I've cut them a little bit bigger than I should have, so hopefully they'll fit. So that. And I'm going to put that one there. Dimensionals on. That's the one I want. Make sure I got the right one. Lucky there's two sides to all paper, isn't there? Monday, what do you expect? And we'll put, no, we'll put that up the top so it's got bigger there. So there you are. Now we'll just get some like that. And we'll just place it there. There we have it. So this is the one I did before, so it's a bit better. So there you are. So that's on page 44 of the annual catalog. Yeah. 
and it's the Ringed with Nature stamp set. Just while I've got you here, uh, I have got the new mini catalog and email me with your name and address if you live in Australia and you don't have a demonstration and you'd like a copy of this. Uh, it's amazing. It's so many great things. If you're in, well, naturally, if you're into uh, Christmas, there's heaps of Christmas stuff. Heaps. There's he Halloween. You should see the Halloween. It's amazing. And it's got autumn stuff here or fall, but you know, we're over winter, so we don't really want that. But I'm sure you could change it into spring flat, spring things if you want and there's lots of other things in there so it'll be amazing also just don't forget the kit sale up to 30 percent off all kits oh not not up to 30 percent on the kits until they're what's available still and that's even the new ones that come out this month as well that you get 30 percent off and don't forget it's really important don't forget to use your vouchers because you've only got august to use them and don't miss out okay and it just makes it life a lot easier if you get a little bit for something for free so i hope you enjoyed this video and um and thank you so much for supporting me and i really do appreciate it so thank you very much and um i'll see you later bye